Hi. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to record narration or voiceover using Active Presenter. With Active Presenter, you can choose to record your computer's screen simultaneously with narration, or you can simply do it in later steps. This video will cover three ways you can use to add narration to your recording. Let's getting started now. First off, you can turn on audio recording function while using Active Presenter's screen recorder. This is the most common way tutorial makers often use. To do that, simply select record video from the start page. Turn on the audio recording function on the floating toolbar. By doing this, you can easily control your mouse action and your narration. All you need is to prepare the script carefully, read it while moving your mouse cursor on the screen. Once you've finished, Active Presenter will save your narration in a separated track on the timeline. You can easily edit, or delete if you are not happy with it. Now I will delete the audio track and create a new one using Active Presenter's audio recording function. The best way is to look for recording narration on top of the timeline. This option will allow you to speak when the recording is still playing in the preview canvas. You will know when to speak and when to keep silent. Don't forget to take a look at the recording settings before you start. Remember to test your input device, and volume too. Hit the red dot to start recording your narration. Once you finish, hit the stop button next to it. Lastly, if you already have a narration file on your computer, you can easily add it to your video easily. Go to Annotation, Audio and choose from File. Then you can select the narration file. That's the end of today's tutorial. Thanks for watching. My next video will cover how to edit audio, remove background noise, and normalize audio using Active Presenter. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Bye for now.